day viewers and this is zion news with your host bellaman nelson and nikio and the beautiful Hola, Shade, a <laughs> all right bringing you the headlines pastor lawrence oil plans portacut take over with 12 hours prayer charge in the month of july do see oyeko holds another edition of the outpouring concert in new york USA and sensational gospel singer Okopi Peterson proposes to his fashion designer fiance Prudent Gabriel. Spirit of Prophecy holds Omobaba Experience concert in Lagos. And evangelist Gloria Bamiloye celebrates 60th birthday in style, honored in Canada by Vision Carriers. Abatua season five dominate youtube charts crew beats farewell to coyote babalola iconic character which is daddy and now to the news in full Pastor Lawrence Oyo embarks on a one-week tour in the city of Portacot as he continues his popular spiritual empowerment program tagged 12 hours prayer charge the program will be taking place in July across the major tertiary institutions in River State, Nigeria. The days are as follows. Ignatius Ajuru University of Education, 23rd of July. River State University, 24th of July. University of Port Harcourt, 25th of July. The program will wrap up with a crusade at the Yakubu Gowan Stadium, formerly called Liberation Stadium, on the 26th of July. It is worthy to note that the 12 hours prayer charge has been held in several cities in the world and also several states in Nigeria, with the recent edition being held in Lagos State of Nigeria. Before. Yes, I attended when he came to Port Harcourt Redeem, Redeem Christian Church of God. And how was it? Fire. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Jesus is something to shout about. Ah, hey, ah, ah. We're on news, go. <laughs> okay. Minister Dusi Oyeko recently held another edition of the Outpouring Concert in New York, USA. Mm -hmm. In March, the concert opened with another edition tagged Upper Room Worship Experience at the 10,000 seater hall of the City of Praise Family Ministries in Maryland, USA. Minister Dusi Oyekon recently held another edition of the Outpouring Concert in New York, USA. Dusi Oyekon had at the time said, after the Upper Room comes the Outpouring. The Outpouring hosted over 13,000 worshippers and also had in attendance the general overseers of the redeemed Christian Church of God. ROCCG, Pastor and Pastor Mrs. Foluke Enoch Adeboye, popularly called Daddy Gio and Mommy Gio. Somebody shout hallelujah. hallelujah. The June edition of the concert at the UBS Arena was described as a ninth of intense worship, fervent intercessory prayers, healing, deliverance, diverse miracles, and massive salvation of souls. Daddy Adeboye ministered alongside Minister Dusin at the concert. Other ministers at the event were Maverick City's Naomi Ryan, Pastor Kunle Ajayi, and Minister Tommy Favored, amongst others. Minister Dusin Oyekon expressed joy in seeing thousands of young people gather at the New York concert. He said, The outpouring is a life non denominational revival meeting and a movement where the Holy Spirit pours himself out upon everyone. The event coincided with Dusin Oyekon's impressive milestone of reaching 100 million streams on Boon Play. Wow, congratulations, Asha! <laughs> the outpouring event and Oyekon's achievement demonstrate the growing global appeal of gospel music and its ability to unite people across cultures and borders. The concert was first held in Lagos in 2021. It has since expanded into locations like Abuja, Elorin, Canada, and 
New York. Mm, wow, wow, this is massive. Massive, indeed. wow. Okay, so moving forward, Nigerian gospel singer Peter C. Okopi has excitedly taken to his social media to announce that he has popped the question to his fiance, Prudent Gabriel. On July 1st, 2024, the gospel singer made a series of Instagram posts to commemorate his recent engagement. And the picture posted, he was seen standing in front of the flowery set up and the Will You Marry Me sign waiting for Prudence to arrive. Mm -hmm. His caption read, In the beginning. In the beginning. <laughs> <laughs> happy New Month, family. You said Happy New Month. <laughs> They don't marry be waiting, happy no, don't, don't be waiting. Don't be waiting. You post me that. God when. <laughs> okay. So Peter Sin also posted his fiance's post, which shows her excitedly showing off a new engagement ring. In her caption, she dotted on him, saying, I said yes mm -hmm. to the one that God proposed specially for me. I love you so much, babe. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Wow. I thank the Lord for bringing you my way. Thank you. <laughs> the video posted to the single's YouTube page shows the romantic moment Prudent walked into the proposal and the emotional moment that followed. Peter Sis started in the video that the day he met her, his heart leapt. In his words, the very first day I met Prudence, mm -hmm. my heart leaped. Mm -hmm. Sorry, leapt. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Peter C. highlighted his favorite thing about his fiancée, emphasizing that she is everything he always prayed for. Oh, God, when? <laughs> Who will pray for me? Hey, mm, it is well. <laughs> mm -hmm. Let the single breathe. Breathe. <laughs> Peter C.'s announcement was welcomed with all round joy by his fan, followers, and fellow celebrities which expressed their excitement in the comment session. The next news. Yeah. Renowned saxophonist BJ Sax, Emma, oh my God, Baba M.O.J., Mike Abdul, Aribo Nifemi, mm -hmm. and the Spirit of David Choir were among the A-list gospel artists that featured at the Omo Baba Experience concert mm -hmm. held on the 30th of June 2023 at the Muson Center, Lagos. Mm -hmm. The event was put together by the Spirit of Prophecy, SOP, of the Redeemed Christian Church of God, RCCG, Living Seed Church of Omole, Lagos. The church is under the pastoral leadership of Pastor Abolaji Adeola. The theme of the Omobaba experience was a ninth of soul staring performance and heartfelt contributions. Speaking on the event, Pastor Adeola said, with the each song by the SOP, Omo Baba, also capturing the hearts of many. Spirit of Prophecy is embarking on a noble mission to extend their reach beyond the music. By utilizing the power of music, SOP intends to create a platform for raising funds mm -hmm. and spreading awareness for orphanages and other charitable endeavors. Wow. He further said that the concert served as an avenue for individuals to contribute their own quota in making a difference in the lives of those in need. The concert had many no notable figures in attendance, such as the son of the general overseer of the RCCG, Pastor Leke Adeboye, Pastor P. Daniel, mm. and our very own Joshua My Bamiloye, aka J. Mikey, Mikey. <laughs> of the Manzion Studio and others. Evangelist Gloria Bamiloye, a renowned gospel minister and mentor, has been celebrating her 60th birthday in grand style back to since back. the beginning of this year. Back to back, <laughs> shut down. <laughs> the milestone has been marked with various celebrations from family, friends, fans worldwide, both online and offline. At the Vision Carriers Convention in March, her husband, Evangelist Mike Bamiloye, declared mm that the entire year would be dedicated to celebrating mommy, Gloria's yes, life and, and ministry. Oh, yeah. 
True to his word, Vision Carriers Canada surprised her with a special celebration during their annual convention, honoring a global impact mm -hmm. as a mother and mentor. Mm -hmm. Doya Bamiloye's legacy as a devoted servant of God, a faithful wife, and a dedicated mother has inspired countless lives. Her birthday celebration are a testament to her tireless effort in spreading the gospel and nurturing generations in faith. Before we wrap up, please do well to follow us on all social media platforms at Zion Culture. And don't forget to subscribe on YouTube. Don't say it doesn't bite. Though. I don't tell you. It does not bite. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> all right, wrapping up. In an impressive feat, Abatwa Season 5 has taken the top spot as the most trending video mm. on YouTube. Massive. Massive. Mm. With his first two episodes garnering over 1 million views mm -hmm. in just two weeks. <laughs> the gospel-based series has resonated with fans mm. who have expressed how the movie has inspired and blessed them. Mm. As the series continues to gain Momentum. The cast and crew bid a heartfelt farewell to Kayo de Babalola, popularly known as Bade, yeah. whose character was tragically killed off <laughs> by Rambo. <laughs> Ten thousand of one no go fit do me anything. Yes. <laughs> the character was tragically killed off in the first episode of season five. Mm -hmm. Babalola's ironic portrayal of Bade has left a lasting impact on the show and its fans. Abatwa season 5 has currently secured the number 2 spot on YouTube most trending videos list, with fans eagerly anticipating the release of upcoming episodes every Sunday. Maybe. The show's success is a testament to powerful storytelling, a talented cast and a dedicated crew. Mm. We have to give it up for Damilola Mike Bamiloye. That guy Sabi their story. Come. It's good. Please let's go back to the recap of the breaking news. Wow, wow. Wow, wow. Pastor Lawrence, all your plans for Taco Takeover with 12 hours prayer charge in the month of July. Okay. The CEO holds another of the outpouring concerts in New York. USA. And sensational singer Okopi Peterson proposes to his fashion designer fiance, Prudent Gabriel. Spirits of Prophecy Olds, Omo Baba Experience, concert in Lagos. And we also told you that Evangelist Gloria Bamiloye celebrates 60th birthday in style as she is honored in Canada by Vision Carriers. And, and lastly, Abatua Season 5 dominates YouTube chat. Crew beats farewell to Kayo de Babalola's ironic character, which is Badi. Oh, yes. So thank you very much for being with us on today's edition of Zion News. Thank you. Do well to subscribe to our page on very YouTube. Very important. It does not bite. Bye. Do not forget, Abatua is still on. <laughs> <laughs>